it was really amazing, I think. So nice to see it on the catwalk. I think it's uh, sophisticated, it's elegant, and it's really beautiful with all the colours and the detailing and fabric. Beautiful. This collection is, is very wearable, it's very well cut, it's very feminine. It's, um, yeah, it's actually a collection that is just like ready to wear and could be put in, in a boutique worldwide. I was so nervous before the show. I mean, the scale of the show was just so huge. It just kind of blew my mind. The great thing about the show was that I could really tell my story by choosing the catwalk, the models, the music, and in collaboration with Robert Rudbeck. I think we reached a really good result. I just like that it makes it longer. Yeah, that's nice. And just, yeah, maybe take some of it off so it's not so bulky. Yeah, make it shorter. For just one layer. I've definitely grown as a designer through this journey. It's been <laughs> just escalating almost every day just into something that I couldn't ever have imagined. One of the outcomes from this competition is that I'm producing the collection in a collaboration with H&M. When I came to Stockholm, I also had a meeting with Anne-Sophie and the production team at the head office to discuss producing my collection that will hit the stores in fall. And hopefully I will see people wearing it in the streets. I think Stina stands out in the way she's well prepared and there's kind of a matureness to her collection. Uh, it's very elegant, sophisticated and also very modern. So it's a very good balance between uh, something innovative uh, and something commercial. I love how she uses colour and makes a statement but it's not an aggressive statement. It's a really subtle but strong statement. It's very contemporary, it's very modern, it's sophisticated, it's, but it's still quite young. And it's quite original. I loved her color combinations and her fabric combinations. I see a bright future. I think Stina is going to take Europe by storm. I think that she has the sensibility to be successful both regionally as well as internationally. In the future, I see myself having my own label. Um, I'm hoping to, of course, developing my, own, my vision as a designer. Stin has got um, already quite a distinctive personal signature and it's something that she can obviously build on. I think she's, she has so much talent, I'm sure she will uh, have success. The journey with this competition has been really amazing and in retrospective, I think I've learned so much. I feel like I couldn't have had a better start to my career as a fashion designer. Um, where it's gonna go now, time will show.